こんにちは。英語のシャドーイング練習教室へようこそ。司会のシャドウです。ここでは役立つ英会話を練習してネイティブ英語を身につけよう。日常生活で使える英語フレーズを10個、10回ずつ読み上げるから、その後に声に出して10回練習しよう。それじゃあ、始めるよう。Jordan, I've been practicing my English listening skills, but I still find it challenging to understand native speakers, especially in casual conversations. Do you have any tips? Jordan, I've been practicing my English listening skills, but I still find it challenging to understand native speakers, especially in casual conversations. Do you have any tips? Jordan, I've been practicing my English listening skills, but I still find it challenging to understand native speakers, especially in casual conversations. Do you have any tips? Jordan, I've been practicing my English listening skills, but I still find it challenging to understand native speakers, especially in casual conversations. Do you have any tips? Jordan, I've been practicing my English listening skills, but I still find it challenging to understand native speakers, especially in casual conversations. Do you have any tips? Jordan, I've been practicing my English listening skills, but I still find it challenging to understand native speakers, especially in casual conversations. Do you have any tips? Jordan, I've been practicing my English listening skills, but I still find it challenging to understand native speakers, especially in casual conversations. Do you have any tips? Jordan, I've been practicing my English listening skills, but I still find it challenging to understand native speakers, especially in casual conversations. Do you have any tips? Jordan, I've been practicing my English listening skills, but I still find it challenging to understand native speakers, especially in casual conversations. Do you have any tips? Jordan, I've been practicing my English listening skills, but I still find it challenging to understand native speakers, especially in casual conversations. Do you have any tips? Absolutely, Alex. Improving listening comprehension, especially with native speakers, can be tough, but there are several strategies you can use. Firstly, try to immerse yourself in the language as much as possible. Listen to English podcasts, watch movies or TV shows, and if possible, engage in conversations with native speakers. Absolutely, Alex. Improving listening comprehension, especially with native speakers, can be tough, 
but there are several strategies you can use. Firstly, try to immerse yourself in the language as much as possible. Listen to English podcasts, watch movies or TV shows, and if possible, engage in conversations with native speakers. Absolutely, Alex. Improving listening comprehension, especially with native speakers, can be tough, but there are several strategies you can use. Firstly, try to immerse yourself in the language as much as possible. Listen to English podcasts, watch movies or TV shows, and if possible, engage in conversations with native speakers. Absolutely, Alex. Improving listening comprehension, especially with native speakers, can be tough, but there are several strategies you can use. Firstly, try to immerse yourself in the language as much as possible. Listen to English podcasts, watch movies or TV shows, and if possible, engage in conversations with native speakers. Absolutely, Alex. Improving listening comprehension, especially with native speakers, can be tough, but there are several strategies you can use. Firstly, try to immerse yourself in the language as much as possible. Listen to English podcasts, watch movies or TV shows, and if possible, engage in conversations with native speakers. Absolutely, Alex. Improving listening comprehension, especially with native speakers, can be tough, but there are several strategies you can use. Firstly, try to immerse yourself in the language as much as possible. Listen to English podcasts, watch movies or TV shows, and if possible, engage in conversations with native speakers. Absolutely, Alex. Improving listening comprehension, especially with native speakers, can be tough, but there are several strategies you can use. Firstly, try to immerse yourself in the language as much as possible. Listen to English podcasts, watch movies or TV shows, and if possible, engage in conversations with native speakers. Absolutely, Alex. Improving listening comprehension, especially with native speakers, can be tough, but there are several strategies you can use. Firstly, try to immerse yourself in the language as much as possible. Listen to English podcasts, watch movies or TV shows, and if possible, engage in conversations with native speakers. Absolutely, Alex. 
Improving listening comprehension, especially with native speakers, can be tough, but there are several strategies you can use. Firstly, try to immerse yourself in the language as much as possible. Listen to English podcasts, watch movies or TV shows, and if possible, engage in conversations with native speakers. Absolutely, Alex. Improving listening comprehension, especially with native speakers, can be tough, but there are several strategies you can use. Firstly, try to immerse yourself in the language as much as possible. Listen to English podcasts, watch movies or TV shows, and if possible, engage in conversations with native speakers. I've been watching movies in English, but sometimes they speak so fast, and I miss a lot. That's common. One useful technique is to watch with subtitles initially, then watch again without them. This helps your ear get used to the speed and rhythm of spoken English. Also, try to focus on the overall context rather than understanding every single word. I've been watching movies in English, but sometimes they speak so fast, and I miss a lot. That's common. One useful technique is to watch with subtitles initially, then watch again without them. This helps your ear get used to the speed and rhythm of spoken English. Also, try to focus on the overall context rather than understanding every single word. I've been watching movies in English, but sometimes they speak so fast, and I miss a lot. That's common. One useful technique is to watch with subtitles initially, then watch again without them. This helps your ear get used to the speed and rhythm of spoken English. Also, try to focus on the overall context rather than understanding every single word. I've been watching movies in English, but sometimes they speak so fast, and I miss a lot. That's common. One useful technique is to watch with subtitles initially, then watch again without them. This helps your ear get used to the speed and rhythm of spoken English. Also, try to focus on the overall context rather than understanding every single word. I've been watching movies in English, but sometimes they speak so fast, and I miss a lot. That's common. One useful technique is to watch with subtitles initially, then watch again without them. This helps your ear get used to the speed and rhythm of spoken English. Also, try to focus on the overall context rather than understanding every single word.
I've been watching movies in English, but sometimes they speak so fast, and I miss a lot. That's common. One useful technique is to watch with subtitles initially, then watch again without them. This helps your ear get used to the speed and rhythm of spoken English. Also, try to focus on the overall context rather than understanding every single word. I've been watching movies in English, but sometimes they speak so fast, and I miss a lot. That's common. One useful technique is to watch with subtitles initially, then watch again without them. This helps your ear get used to the speed and rhythm of spoken English. Also, try to focus on the overall context rather than understanding every single word. I've been watching movies in English, but sometimes they speak so fast, and I miss a lot. That's common. One useful technique is to watch with subtitles initially, then watch again without them. This helps your ear get used to the speed and rhythm of spoken English. Also, try to focus on the overall context rather than understanding every single word. I've been watching movies in English, but sometimes they speak so fast, and I miss a lot. That's common. One useful technique is to watch with subtitles initially, then watch again without them. This helps your ear get used to the speed and rhythm of spoken English. Also, try to focus on the overall context rather than understanding every single word. I've been watching movies in English, but sometimes they speak so fast, and I miss a lot. That's common. One useful technique is to watch with subtitles initially, then watch again without them. This helps your ear get used to the speed and rhythm of spoken English. Also, try to focus on the overall context rather than understanding every single word. Focus on the context, not every word. Got it. What about understanding different accents? Exposure is key for accents. Listen to media from various English-speaking countries, the UK, the USA, Australia, etc. Each has its own accent and colloquialisms. Over time, your ability to understand different accents will improve. Focus on the context, not every word. Got it. What about understanding different accents? Exposure is key for accents. Listen to media from various English-speaking countries, the UK, the USA, Australia, etc. Each has its own accent and colloquialisms. Over time, your ability to understand different accents will improve.
Focus on the context, not every word. Got it. What about understanding different accents? Exposure is key for accents. Listen to media from various English-speaking countries, the UK, the USA, Australia, etc. Each has its own accent and colloquialisms. Over time, your ability to understand different accents will improve. Focus on the context, not every word. Got it. What about understanding different accents? Exposure is key for accents. Listen to media from various English-speaking countries, the UK, the USA, Australia, etc. Each has its own accent and colloquialisms. Over time, your ability to understand different accents will improve. Focus on the context, not every word. Got it. What about understanding different accents? Exposure is key for accents. Listen to media from various English-speaking countries, the UK, the USA, Australia, etc. Each has its own accent and colloquialisms. Over time, your ability to understand different accents will improve. Focus on the context, not every word. Got it. What about understanding different accents? Exposure is key for accents. Listen to media from various English-speaking countries, the UK, the USA, Australia, etc. Each has its own accent and colloquialisms. Over time, your ability to understand different accents will improve. Focus on the context, not every word. Got it. What about understanding different accents? Exposure is key for accents. Listen to media from various English-speaking countries, the UK, the USA, Australia, etc. Each has its own accent and colloquialisms. Over time, your ability to understand different accents will improve. Focus on the context, not every word. Got it. What about understanding different accents? Exposure is key for accents. Listen to media from various English-speaking countries, the UK, the USA, Australia, etc. Each has its own accent and colloquialisms. Over time, your ability to understand different accents will improve. Focus on the context, not every word. Got it. What about understanding different accents? Exposure is key for accents. Listen to media from various English-speaking countries, the UK, the USA, Australia, etc. 
Each has its own accent and colloquialisms. Over time, your ability to understand different accents will improve. Focus on the context, not every word. Got it. What about understanding different accents? Exposure is key for accents. Listen to media from various English-speaking countries, the UK, the USA, Australia, etc. Each has its own accent and colloquialisms. Over time, your ability to understand different accents will improve. That makes sense. Are there any specific exercises I can do to improve? Yes, you can practice active listening. For example, listen to a short audio clip and then try to summarize what you heard. This exercise helps improve your ability to grasp the main points. Another exercise is to fill in the gaps in transcribed dialogues while listening. That makes sense. Are there any specific exercises I can do to improve? Yes, you can practice active listening. For example, listen to a short audio clip and then try to summarize what you heard. This exercise helps improve your ability to grasp the main points. Another exercise is to fill in the gaps in transcribed dialogues while listening. That makes sense. Are there any specific exercises I can do to improve? Yes, you can practice active listening. For example, listen to a short audio clip and then try to summarize what you heard. This exercise helps improve your ability to grasp the main points. Another exercise is to fill in the gaps in transcribed dialogues while listening. That makes sense. Are there any specific exercises I can do to improve? Yes, you can practice active listening. For example, listen to a short audio clip and then try to summarize what you heard. This exercise helps improve your ability to grasp the main points. Another exercise is to fill in the gaps in transcribed dialogues while listening. That makes sense. Are there any specific exercises I can do to improve? Yes, you can practice active listening. For example, listen to a short audio clip and then try to summarize what you heard. This exercise helps improve your ability to grasp the main points. Another exercise is to fill in the gaps in transcribed dialogues while listening. That makes sense. Are there any specific exercises I can do to improve? 
Yes, you can practice active listening. For example, listen to a short audio clip and then try to summarize what you heard. This exercise helps improve your ability to grasp the main points. Another exercise is to fill in the gaps in transcribed dialogues while listening. That makes sense. Are there any specific exercises I can do to improve? Yes, you can practice active listening. For example, listen to a short audio clip and then try to summarize what you heard. This exercise helps improve your ability to grasp the main points. Another exercise is to fill in the gaps in transcribed dialogues while listening. That makes sense. Are there any specific exercises I can do to improve? Yes, you can practice active listening. For example, listen to a short audio clip and then try to summarize what you heard. This exercise helps improve your ability to grasp the main points. Another exercise is to fill in the gaps in transcribed dialogues while listening. That makes sense. Are there any specific exercises I can do to improve? Yes, you can practice active listening. For example, listen to a short audio clip and then try to summarize what you heard. This exercise helps improve your ability to grasp the main points. Another exercise is to fill in the gaps in transcribed dialogues while listening. That makes sense. Are there any specific exercises I can do to improve? Yes, you can practice active listening. For example, listen to a short audio clip and then try to summarize what you heard. This exercise helps improve your ability to grasp the main points. Another exercise is to fill in the gaps in transcribed dialogues while listening. That sounds helpful. Sometimes I also find it hard to keep up because of all the slang and idiomatic expressions. That's a challenge for many learners. That sounds helpful. Sometimes I also find it hard to keep up because of all the slang and idiomatic expressions. That's a challenge for many learners. That sounds helpful. Sometimes I also find it hard to keep up because of all the slang and idiomatic expressions. That's a challenge for many learners. That sounds helpful. Sometimes I also find it hard to keep up because of all the slang and idiomatic expressions. That's a challenge for many learners. That sounds helpful. Sometimes I also find it hard to keep up because of all the slang and idiomatic expressions. 
that's a challenge for many learners. That sounds helpful. Sometimes I also find it hard to keep up because of all the slang and idiomatic expressions. That's a challenge for many learners. That sounds helpful. Sometimes I also find it hard to keep up because of all the slang and idiomatic expressions. That's a challenge for many learners. That sounds helpful. Sometimes I also find it hard to keep up because of all the slang and idiomatic expressions. That's a challenge for many learners. That sounds helpful. Sometimes I also find it hard to keep up because of all the slang and idiomatic expressions. That's a challenge for many learners. That sounds helpful. Sometimes I also find it hard to keep up because of all the slang and idiomatic expressions. That's a challenge for many learners. When you encounter slang or an idiom, write it down and look it up. Over time, you'll build up your knowledge of these expressions. Also, listening to more informal types of media, like talk shows or podcasts, can be very useful for this. When you encounter slang or an idiom, write it down and look it up. Over time, you'll build up your knowledge of these expressions. Also, listening to more informal types of media, like talk shows or podcasts, can be very useful for this. When you encounter slang or an idiom, write it down and look it up. Over time, you'll build up your knowledge of these expressions. Also, listening to more informal types of media, like talk shows or podcasts, can be very useful for this. When you encounter slang or an idiom, write it down and look it up. Over time, you'll build up your knowledge of these expressions. Also, listening to more informal types of media, like talk shows or podcasts, can be very useful for this. When you encounter slang or an idiom, write it down and look it up. Over time, you'll build up your knowledge of these expressions. Also, listening to more informal types of media, like talk shows or podcasts, can be very useful for this. When you encounter slang or an idiom, write it down and look it up. Over time, you'll build up your knowledge of these expressions. Also, listening to more informal types of media, like talk shows or podcasts, can be very useful for this. When you encounter slang or an idiom, write it down and look it up. 
Over time, you'll build up your knowledge of these expressions. Also, listening to more informal types of media, like talk shows or podcasts, can be very useful for this. When you encounter slang or an idiom, write it down and look it up. Over time, you'll build up your knowledge of these expressions. Also, listening to more informal types of media, like talk shows or podcasts, can be very useful for this. When you encounter slang or an idiom, write it down and look it up. Over time, you'll build up your knowledge of these expressions. Also, listening to more informal types of media, like talk shows or podcasts, can be very useful for this. When you encounter slang or an idiom, write it down and look it up. Over time, you'll build up your knowledge of these expressions. Also, listening to more informal types of media, like talk shows or podcasts, can be very useful for this. I'll definitely start doing that more. Any other tips? Practice regularly and be patient with yourself. Listening skills take time to develop. I'll definitely start doing that more. Any other tips? Practice regularly and be patient with yourself. Listening skills take time to develop. I'll definitely start doing that more. Any other tips? Practice regularly and be patient with yourself. Listening skills take time to develop. I'll definitely start doing that more. Any other tips? Practice regularly and be patient with yourself. Listening skills take time to develop. I'll definitely start doing that more. Any other tips? Practice regularly and be patient with yourself. Listening skills take time to develop. I'll definitely start doing that more. Any other tips? Practice regularly and be patient with yourself. Listening skills take time to develop. I'll definitely start doing that more. Any other tips? Practice regularly and be patient with yourself. Listening skills take time to develop. I'll definitely start doing that more. Any other tips? Practice regularly and be patient with yourself. Listening skills take time to develop. I'll definitely start doing that more. Any other tips? Practice regularly and be patient with yourself. Listening skills take time to develop.
I'll definitely start doing that more. Any other tips? Practice regularly and be patient with yourself. Listening skills take time to develop. Also, try to relax when listening. Stress can actually make it harder to understand. Remember, it's okay not to catch every word. With consistent practice, you'll find that you understand more and more. Also, try to relax when listening. Stress can actually make it harder to understand. Remember, it's okay not to catch every word. With consistent practice, you'll find that you understand more and more. Also, try to relax when listening. Stress can actually make it harder to understand. Remember, it's okay not to catch every word. With consistent practice, you'll find that you understand more and more. Also, try to relax when listening. Stress can actually make it harder to understand. Remember, it's okay not to catch every word. With consistent practice, you'll find that you understand more and more. Also, try to relax when listening. Stress can actually make it harder to understand. Remember, it's okay not to catch every word. With consistent practice, you'll find that you understand more and more. Also, try to relax when listening. Stress can actually make it harder to understand. Remember, it's okay not to catch every word. With consistent practice, you'll find that you understand more and more. Also, try to relax when listening. Stress can actually make it harder to understand. Remember, it's okay not to catch every word. With consistent practice, you'll find that you understand more and more. Also, try to relax when listening. Stress can actually make it harder to understand. Remember, it's okay not to catch every word. With consistent practice, you'll find that you understand more and more. Also, try to relax when listening. Stress can actually make it harder to understand. Remember, it's okay not to catch every word. With consistent practice, you'll find that you understand more and more. Also, try to relax when listening. Stress can actually make it harder to understand. Remember, it's okay not to catch every word. With consistent practice, you'll find that you understand more and more. Thanks for the advice, Jordan. I'll keep practicing and hopefully, I'll see improvements soon. You're welcome, Alex. Just keep at it, 
and you'll definitely notice progress. Good luck! Thanks for the advice, Jordan. I'll keep practicing and hopefully, I'll see improvement soon. You're welcome, Alex. Just keep at it, and you'll definitely notice progress. Good luck. Thanks for the advice, Jordan. I'll keep practicing and hopefully, I'll see improvement soon. You're welcome, Alex. Just keep at it, and you'll definitely notice progress. Good luck. Thanks for the advice, Jordan. I'll keep practicing and hopefully, I'll see improvement soon. You're welcome, Alex. Just keep at it, and you'll definitely notice progress. Good luck. Thanks for the advice, Jordan. I'll keep practicing and hopefully, I'll see improvement soon. You're welcome, Alex. Just keep at it, and you'll definitely notice progress. Good luck. Thanks for the advice, Jordan. I'll keep practicing and hopefully, I'll see improvement soon. You're welcome, Alex. Just keep at it, and you'll definitely notice progress. Good luck. Thanks for the advice, Jordan. I'll keep practicing and hopefully, I'll see improvement soon. You're welcome, Alex. Just keep at it, and you'll definitely notice progress. Good luck. Thanks for the advice, Jordan. I'll keep practicing and hopefully, I'll see improvement soon. You're welcome, Alex. Just keep at it, and you'll definitely notice progress. Good luck. Thanks for the advice, Jordan. I'll keep practicing and hopefully, I'll see improvement soon. You're welcome, Alex. Just keep at it, and you'll definitely notice progress. Good luck. Thanks for the advice, Jordan. I'll keep practicing and hopefully, I'll see improvement soon. You're welcome, Alex. Just keep at it, and you'll definitely notice progress. Good luck. もしよかったらチャンネル登録をお願いします。それじゃ、またね。